Hey friends, what's up? Kaz here. Welcome back to another server admin tutorial or bucket spigot plugin tutorial. If you're doing it for the first time, feel free to hit that subscribe button because I do these every week. If you have a suggestion of one you'd like me to do, feel free to comment that in jibbles below. If you find this video helpful, please leave a like because that helps me out for helping you guys out. And this is the second part of Prison 3 plugin. This is talking about the ranks portion. We talked about the mines portion last week, so be sure to check the link in the jibbles below. Uh, for that tutorial if you want to catch up on the mines. First things first, we're going to take a look at we're going to go prison modules and then you can see that you have both of those. You can enable and disable these in the config and actually we're staying completely out of the config this week because ranks is done all in game which is pretty cool. So you want to just do ranks, you're going to see a list of all of the commands that are available to you. Now obviously I am admin and op so I can see a lot more commands than the normal people. The two permission nodes that you really want to worry about is ranks.user which is on by default for everybody. So you don't really need to add that one. And you have ranks.admin. So if you want to split up some of the commands and all that stuff you can do that if you like to. However, probably just keep it simple. Use those two permission and go from there. So we want to do a ranks create plugin. So we can do ranks list and we can see that we have no ranks at all and this is just the default ladder so if you did ranks list and then you did another ladder like a cop ladder or guard ladder or something like that you can also have multiple different kinds of ways that people can rank up also pretty cool with this plugin you can actually run multiple prefixes so we'll get around to that you can see i have a prefix of admin already and then the this has its own prison rank prefix that is outside of your permissions group rank so let's get into a demonstration we're gonna do ranks create and it'll tell us the command and all that we need to do we can do ranks create we're gonna call this a and then we're gonna call it we're going to say it costs no money. So now one of the downsides is people automatically will not be added to this rank. They have to actually rank up to this rank. And then we're going to do kind of some fun prefix or the tag. That would be that in there. So default is the default ladder. And then we got this tag. So we're going to do uh, six A and then ampersand A. There we go. We have that rank and it doesn't cost any money. So if we do money, we have 150 bucks and we're going to do rank up. Congratulations, you have now ranked up to A. So now you can see A, that tag in there. For that tag to show up, you need to put curly bracket prison underscore rank and curly bracket in your chat plugin. So in the example you're seeing here, that's essentials chat in that section of the config. And that's how you modify and you can put that anywhere you want. You can put it before, you can put it after, you can put it after the message if you want to do something crazy. So now you can see if we do ranks list, we see an uh, A in there and it's blanks. We're going to do ranks create. We're going to do another one. We're going to do B. We're going to call it 50 bucks to get in there. Default A. Some more fun. Uh, so now we've created another rank. So we're going to do ranks list. You can see that in there. Now... Keep in mind, we haven't done anything about modifying any kind of permissions. So we haven't done anything about changing where they have access to or anything like that because this is all in its own rank up plugin to modify uh, money and modify all that. You have to actually make your own commands, which is beneficial because this plugin will work for any kind of permissions plugin out there, whether you're using luck perms or PEX or still using group manager for some weird reason. But you have to manually put in the command to change them to that rank for every one of these. So we can go ahead and we can do ranks command add and then we're going to do it for B. So when they rank up to B, it'll run this command. And we're going to do, so if you're running PEX, you want to already set up all of your, your ranks and groups and or all your permissions groups in there before you start setting up your rank ups in here so that you would just do PEX, promote, and then a player, and that's a variable for player. And then if you want to do the ladder default that you've already set up in permissions X, you probably just leave that blank and would go for the default anyway. You can even do something crazy as like PEX, uh, user, player, group, um, 
add or you could do set b then it would it would it would wipe out any other groups that they're in which might not be the best you probably want to do the promote and demote if you're not sure how to set up your permissions plugin this a permissions plugin is the first step to running a public server because it modifies it uh controls all players access to different commands all that stuff so you need to set that up whether it's permissions x or luck perms or group manager i have links to all of those i have tutorials for each one of those on how to set those up <clears throat> so this is permissions x if you have luck perms you probably do lp user player promote and then whatever the ladder is default maybe whatever you set in luck perms like i said check in the for the tutorial below the benefit of this plugin is it does let you do whatever you want so it'll work for whatever permissions plugin you decide to use the the downside is it does require a lot more setup before you even start setting up your ranks and it requires you to understand your permissions plugin that much more you can also delete ranks if you do ranks delete b keep in mind the um Command is case sensitive, so if you have to lowercase or uppercase, whatever, it has to be the same case, and then any players in that rank will be demoted. So now you can see that we're back in that A group. So for the example, we're actually gonna do a warp. So we're gonna warp B and then the player, we're gonna do B and then player. So we've already set up a warp called B, and then we're running this command against the player keep in mind all the commands that you're going to put in are run from the console so they always need a player identifier they're not run as that player so i couldn't just do warp b because then the server doesn't know who to run that command again okay so now we're going to go ahead and rank up to warp to the b we have a hundred dollars in our our fund so we're going to do rank up and it's going to teleport us to the b warp that we already set up and then we are going to see that it took $50 away from our balance and that we are now in that rank B. Now, keep in mind, you also have to set it up to change it to the permission nodes if you want to restrict people access based upon groups, all that stuff to different locations on your server. So ladders, you can also, when you're creating your ranks, you can do ranks, create name. So we'll just do guard and then cost of $100 and then you can call it the guard rank or whatever you want. So if you can have multiple different types of rank rather than just the A through B or um, whatever the rank system is that you want. So it's more than just prisons. You can also use this rank up system for other stuff. Just disable the mine portion of all this. That way when you rank up, then you would just do rank up and then the ladder name that's pretty much it so hopefully that was pretty helpful i know it's a lot in there because there's a lot this is a very small portion of actually fully building your rank ups plugin because you also need to do a lot of work in your permissions plugin so if you do not have a strong grasp on your permissions plugin please check out my associated tutorial in regards to whatever permission plugin you're using i have a group manager permissions x and luck perms which are the three big ones so go ahead and check those out and hopefully gets you up and running. You need to set all that up before you start setting up your rank ups. But you can create all the commands. You can have it do run multiple commands by just continually adding commands so it can warp them to it, launch some fireworks, and set them to the group that they need to be set all in one swift motion. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. This is Kyle's reminding you guys all enjoy the game. Yes.